Hello, hello, and welcome to a brief recording. Well, I shouldn't say brief. I'm not actually sure how long I'll be recording this for. This is a game I got a while back. I actually recorded like 10, 12 episodes of it. I never actually named them, numbered them, anything. Um, just kind of recorded them, then forgot about them. I've since started actually playing this a little myself while I was waiting for Dishonored 2 to download. I'm actually going to play a little bit of it now. Oh, uh, not this one. Reset. Just after losing most of my uh, drones with the <sighs> nice equipment. Basically, the premise of this game is you are the surviving pilot of a ship. Every other ship nearby has been fucked up. There's weird creatures on board now, and you have no idea why. This is Dusker's. Uh, I think I said that, but yeah, that's what it's called. And uh, it's a roguelike. What's it? Yeah, it's, you call it a roguelike. But and your basically the whole purpose is as you go to ships, you get a me you may get a message that you're able to somewhat salvage. Sometimes they will have gibberish in there, as you can see in here at uh, points. Um, but like, but regardless, you get messages and. They can either go into unfiled or go into different um, theories as to what could have um, caused all this. A pandemic, a cosmic event, great goo, singularity, then there's just generic stuff. And I've already played this a bit, so I've gotten some stuff already. So I'm going to go through it all. I didn't even realize I had that. Uh, listen, if I had known about ISHO outposts issuing a quarantine bypass, I wouldn't be doing this. Remember, if this doesn't work, it's on you. Quarantine bypass cross-referenced. Excerpt. Uh, required to access quarantine vessels under lockdown. I have a small, uh, I have a small lab aboard, so I can start on an analy. I have a small lab aboard, so I can start on an analyzer. I'll need another sample from a quarantine from from a quarantined vessels. That's poor. Uh, to determine if this is all the same pathogen, the uh, the attached algorithm will gather pathogen data if used to scan an organic host. Just um, yeah, um, um, make sure the scan is adequate. If the data something scan is sufficient, you'll be something the location to deliver the, the data. Files downloaded, scanning documentation, uh, recommended course of action. Locate and dock with quarantine vessel. Uh, lure biological organism into docking bay and secure. Algorithm will scan uh, automatically once docking bay is secure. That was a actually sub thing too. Jeb, this message is from the emergency relays, forwarding in, in its entirety. I have to let the bodies go. I have to get them off the ship and minimize the risk of infection. I've relayed the situation to all ISSO, ISHO outposts. Hopefully they can get the data that I need to understand the pattern and stop this from spreading further. Need to get to my lab, we don't have much time. Uh, linking, with t uh, linking with theory index pandemic, infection, bot and body suggest further inquiry. ISHO cross-referenced, International Space Health Organization, recommend a course of action, investigate medical communications for further data, theory. Only extremely violent pathogen with the perfect storm of attributes would suffice as an existential risk. This seems uh, uh, less likely given the distributed nature of a spacefaring civilization, however there means of transmission uh, there may be means of transmission that we're unaware of. And then there's that one. And support him. Uh, there is uh, apparently gave uh, locations of ISHO, ISHO medical outposts. And now here's this. The sequence of events simply doesn't add up. Gibberish. Uh, mint from loss of contact, and nothing suggests there is a disturbance in space time. Whoever wrote this report, uh, wrote this report, are only seeing things they want to see. Linking with uh, theory index cosmic event, space time and uncertainty suggest cosmic anomaly as a cause of existential risk. The subjective truth is that the reports present a an element of sufficiency that is not normally found in nature. They a pattern. The first, uh, first loss of communication, then loss of location. Uh, 
will uh, require further military investigation. Military involvement highlighted, recommended course of action, or additional log data for military vessels. It is clear that given our nascent understanding of the universe, there are dangers we do not understand, like a fisherman setting out on, t t on the ocean unaware of typhoons. These cosmic events could therefore make themselves evident at any moment. Then there are, ver are various advancements in technology, many of which could trigger such an event before you could fully understand what we've done, and it would be impossible to get the genie back in, that uh, back in the bottle. Is it me, or is this happening way too fast and over too much space to be some sort of attack? I'm not the only one thinking this, right? This, if the situational evidence leans firmly towards some co form of cosmic anomaly, maybe radiation storm, GRB, or supernatural event. Uh, I'm going to send out a request for some... Uh, should get replies very sharpish. Don't want answers, I won't care from who, who from. Easier the military too. If you can start to whittle down this mountain possible theories, that would be great. Small warning to hopefully dive in. Prepare yourself, some real weird shit. Uh, linking with uh, uh, index theory, cosmic event due to cosmic anomaly and radiation storm. Uh, recommend course of action, gather additional observation and research outpost communications. Grey goo. Uh, fix the replic food replicator on B-Wing. Just a hiccup in the commu communicator. Firing crazy signal to the molecular uh, assemblers. No problem though, uh, now though. Made myself an amazing slice of lemon meringue before the little fellow started firing on all c cylinders again. Though that anyone will complain, as fine as, uh, uh, as fine as that pie. I'll fire a report out to Wayland when I get back up to engineering. Let them know their babies are all good. A linking to Tyrion Dex Great Goo, molecular resembles, reference require further investigation. Re uh, recommend course of action. Gather further da log data about molecular assemblers from space stations or fuel depots. Given assumed advances in nanotechnology, molecular assemblers pose a definite, uh, definitive existential risk. Assemblers can create other assemblers, self-replicate. Do you see how uh, quickly rogue or intended processes could transform matter at exponential rate? It follows that such processes could be detrimental to humans directly, if we ourselves were deemed appropriate source material, or indirectly, if and we rely on was de uh, deemed accessible, uh, acceptable source material. Say, like the... You need air. The source material was the, you know, air purifiers. Or what? Or whatever. You know, the site of the spaceship. Or you know, so on and so forth. It could easily go tits up. Uh, Wayland molecular assembler maintenance and guidelines expected parts per million. There's that. Please ensure that you configure a, a vessel scan to utilize the something algorithm. Refer to section four uh, B. And the concerns and queries about the part per million count values should be directed towards your Wayland liaison officer. Reference uh, molecular assembler accounts are acquired. Uh, the algorithm in, uh, integrated the great Google theory could, would posit uh, an, an anomaly, abnormally high quantity of molecular assemblers. Scanning vessel with a large populace could confirm or deny this and is recommended. Uh, scan all rooms on a class A or B space station. Singularity. Just received a letter from Q QRA. We didn't get approval. Your evolutionary algorithm design intrinsically violates seven restint, restint me mechanisms required to find in section something 1A and 141C. It's bullshit. There's no way that there's a violation. I'm going to get about writing appeal, uh, writing the appeal this afternoon. I'm guessing what sometimes what the gibberish is. Uh, we saw this one with the deep vessel AI system pr proposal, and we won that one. What do you think? Something it didn't on the Atlant. Uh, linking the theory uh, index singularity AI uh, suggests we need further inquiry. Uh, recommend course of action: gather additional communications from Muteki vessels. An artificial intelligence orders of magnitude more intelligent than humans will pose. Um, Um, there's an update. I've recently cleared space off my computer, so now Microsoft's going to be a nuisance and try and update. Um, I've been enjoying blissful non updatedness for for the last bit because I just didn't, didn't have the space. Um, then I tried to install Final Fantasy XIV, and now I have space again. It's because I had to move all my downloads off. I had like 14 gigs of 
gubbins and porn. So, with that off, you know, I had enough space for updates. May need to move some of that back. Uh, AI is capable of recursive self-improvement, progressively redesigning themselves, and autonomously building better versions of themselves. We take advantage of the law of accelerating returns that only surpass, but very quickly far surpass, human intelligence. The rate of this advancement will be tremendous when compared to historical precedent, and such an AI will quickly become uncontrollable by its human creators, like a chicken trying to contain Einstein. And I didn't miss any supporting. And yet, those are just two occasions. Uh, with the approval of the cross-fleet installation of the AI monitoring systems, the forward, forward research programs, the following research programs aboard Mutaki vessels will be reopened to align with the rollout. And those are the vessels, and they, um, I think it's like one, uh, it has the system they're in, and the, um, the name of the ship, uh, as well as the AI, they're part, they have the sovereign genie or oracle. So, if you want to get all three, then well, I assume you're gonna we're gonna have to go mess with all three type uh, types of vessels at some stage. So, you know, we'll have to keep that all these in mind. Uh, all vessel communications are required to be archived as per whatever in their mandate. Multiple AI classifications detected, Sovereign, Genie, and Oracle. Submitted a supplemental and looked to determine further course of action. Yeah, but it could have been stopped. In fact, it could have been prevented. Uh, mo monitoring systems that can think about these things faster and better than humans. No room for human error. It's not like an AI to ponder the meaning of life. We simply t we're simply talking security, safety, and navigation. No, its use of meaning of life is incorrect. Meaning can only be constructed and cannot be pondered. A theory and people are dead, Joe. A something and people are dead, Joe. They've nev they're never, there has never been a more suitable time. Right now, our rhetoric is strong and uh, something. Have a duty as scientists to try. We can get this contract. The govern public is facing this, uh, facing on this. We can be that face. A supplement to singularity due to mention of AI. Uh, Supplement uh, submitted is supplemental, unable to determine further course of action. Uh, and here's some unfiled ones. Uh, summary: Plant uh, uh, primary objectives. Ah, yes, this is just to give you a bit of an information on what to do. Gather intel slash logs from derelict spacecraft. Gather materials necessary for survival. Search for survivors. If uh, objectives cannot be completed, recommend action. Initiate reset. James, have you been uh, receiving my communications? Sent several to Lucy for. Uh, so, something um, from Sean that she uh, hadn't received hasn't received any. Spoke to Tech and none of are backed up in the server. AKA as far as they're concerned, they weren't sent either. This on the inf uh, interior channels. It's see if this is an external issue or something. My name is Captain G. Asked a transmission I re was received was over twenty days ago, excluding automated relays. I'm overwriting this log in hopes that another survivor finds it here. It was odd to type survivor, but I believe that's what we are. We'll be staying if you're out here. We'll be broadcasting on emergency 0001. Warning: vessel recoil fail. Calculations consist with projected anomaly re-entry. Initial scans and telemetry inconsistent with previous readings. Um, calculations consistent with a projected anomaly re-entry, initial scans and telemetry inconsistent with previous readings, common registration points contain variants outside of acceptable thresholds, scanning for uh, possible malfunctions, external monitoring process shows no sign of malfunction, recommend a course of action, proceed with exploration and previous objectives. Not sure what that's about. As a side point, you can't re-enter a vessel once you've exited it, so do, do as much as you can, then fuck off. I can't find it anywhere. What do you mean by that, Jay? I mean, it's not on servers anymore. Well, something different. Different how? It looks like someone attempted to access it, or activate it. I mean, maybe I'm just paranoid or something. We hit something power surge recently. Could it be that? Jesus, I'm going to have to contact Zoe and tell her that the Mutaki archives are compromised, aren't I? Man, something screwed up. I can't really explain that uh, what I mean right now, but what I can tell you... Uh, I detected 
wave fluctuations in the central zone of the anomaly, something of disruption then and uh, then, and this is where it gets really interesting, we detected the signal, not a uh, uh, presumably could not make out a message. It was clear that whatever was sending the signal was a uh, signal that was human, the origin point, some form of vessel, a probe from what I could tell. Uh, we have to cross-reference all of this, because it could easily be some floating wreckage still firing. But James, this is really, really exciting. And with that, we're going to continue. We're here in this uh, the Roma system. We can pop out here to the uh, Varilla Mushi galaxy, and there's no data on the universe. So, and all these have their own different names. There's trading posts, they require scrap. Uh, black arches? That sounds awesome. Also, the Duke of Burgundy. That sounds fantastic. Let us visit the Duke. It's a medical ship. And we start off, and basically the whole thing of the game is you have pro uh, drones. You send these drones into the ship. They're how you interact with the game, basically. Here we go. I'll show you what this is like. Let's see. Ooh, we got some uh, details here. It says what system and galaxy, and the name of the ship. Um, basically, it tells us where some more ISHO medical vessels are. Basically. Oh, and the holder is surgical robotic equipment. Surgical robotic equipment. Would that be relevant to us? Probably not. There's one, only one type of infestation. Good, I didn't actually check. Now you can do a thing called an alias, which I've never actually done before. Actually, no, I did do an audio test. Good. A-L-I, alias. Now you can do an alias to basically say, see the one at the start. Begin. Open A1, navigate 1 to A1, generator 2, status. Basically, uh, when you say to open A1, it opens door A1. It's airlock 1. Navigate 1, 2, uh, makes one, uh, drone 1 and 2 move to a, a true A1. If you designate a door frame to be move, to be navigated to, the drones will be moved to the other side of it, into the room to, on the other side. If you nav tell them to move to a particular room, then they'll move direct to that room. If they're, say, in room 2, and door A1 is not directly connected to, a, uh, to room 2, then they will not move. So you need to use, tell them to go to a particular room in that case. Um, I'm not sure what status does. End equals navigate 1, 2, 3, 4, room 1. That will send them all, all your drones back to room 1. I'm happy with these. Again. I don't need to do and Actually, the first rooms are always safe, though they mightn't always stay safe. It's quite... I got onto a ship before, and immediately a enemy started pounding on the door. They can do that. I actually need to alter the alias. File looks okay. Keep in mind that only the structure, not the contents, have been evaluated. So, yeah, it's just making sure you phrase this right. Oh. Control S. There we go. So, uh, we'll just navigate this normally. Tree R2. Now, for anyone worried that this is all the game looks like, that's not the case at all. This is the rest of it. Um. You can take control of different drones, um, and they all have their own different camera. So, uh, this one looks like this, this looks like this, and that looks like that. Uh, and their cameras can not get broken off, but you can still control them sometimes. Stuff like that. I'm hearing some distortion in there, and it's unnerving me. Sadly, I don't have a... Let's move Jill to gather. Regrettably, I don't have any... Um, let me just get the generator running. Control Luke, personally. 
regrettably I don't have uh, motion controls. Sorry, not motion controls. Um, um, what do you call it? 